Caligula, who is known as Julius Caesar Augustus, who wrote her name not only in Roman but also in world history, is a name that has signed many scandals. He is known as the cruelest, most insane emperor of today's world. If you are ready, let's take a short journey in history together. Caligula was born 12 years old in Ems. He died in 41. During this time, he ascended the throne at the age of 29 and remained at the head of the Roman Empire for four years. Caligula is the nickname of Gaius Julius Caesar Augustus Germanicus, known as the third Roman emperor of the Roman Empire. The name Caligula means little boots, as he wore military attire as a child. Caligula was born in 37 AD in Germany. While his father served with Germanicus' Roman army, Caligula grew up with him in military camps. He became the adopted nephew of Tiberius, who ascended the Roman throne after his father. Tiberius chose Caligula as his heir and returned to Rome with him. However, Caligula, who grew up under the persecution and pressure of Tiberius, had to wait as heir to the throne after Tiberius' death. Caligula became Roman emperor and ascended the throne in 37 AD. At first, the young emperor was well received by the public because he was seen as a promising lead. But Caligula's reign began to fade as time went on as his sanity deteriorated and his thoughts became increasingly paranoid and despotic. Caligula's reign was full of violent decisions and scandals. In the administration of the empire, he displayed irrational and vicious attitudes, brutally suppressed opposition, and showed sadistic tendencies. He also embarked on wealth and grandiose displays, confiscating the property and families of his dead enemies. Caligula, who fell ill shortly after becoming emperor, thought someone had poisoned her, and then killed any family members who might rival her. His paranoia intensifies after this incident. Caligula, who is often on the agenda with his extravagance, broke the record by having a palace built for his horse, which he declared as a senator. Fearing that her hair would fall out and going into a baldness complex over time, Caligula forbade her citizens to look at her hair from above, and then ordered that all people shave their hair at certain times. Having an incestuous relationship with his three sisters, Caligula started to employ his two sisters in a brothel. It is said that during Caligula's reign, he entrusted important state duties to those he called his lover. It has been recorded that Caligula overreacted to the death of his beloved brother Drusilla and mourned after him. Caligula began to see himself as a god and demanded to be worshipped. He built temples in his name in Rome and was deified. Seeing himself as a living god, Caligula tried to get his horse into the Senate after declaring his sister a goddess as well. He had a serious god complex. The sick mood made him dress like different god figures and attend events and invitations. He begins to believe that he is a god so much that he wants temples built for him and finally announces that he will be moved to Alexandria as a god. Famous for his endless tortures, Caligula is said to be a sadist. It is said that he hanged the people he wanted to kill by their feet, and cut and chewed their genitals alive to humiliate them. He used to burn people on fire for his pleasure and kill people for fun. He tortured people of all kinds. Caligula is a name that opens a whole new dimension to brutality with his brutality and tools specially designed for his victims. Caligula, 
who sometimes wants to organize expeditions when he remembers that he is emperor, once recruited soldiers to take over Britain. Later, when he comes to the seaside, he gives up this expedition, collects seashells on the beach with his soldiers, and returns to Rome again. To collect taxes, he had chosen a method that would befit his sincerity, killing the rich and taking all their money. Taxes were collected in this way throughout his reign. Of course, people who weren't really wealthy were also killing. Throughout his reign, he took repressive and cruel actions against the Senate and the opposition, some members of the Senate and nobles were subjected to his violent behavior. He faced various oppositions and conspiracies throughout Caligula's reign, but the most famous and tragic event was his assassination in 41 AD. The murder of his emperor was the result of a conspiracy of the Praetorian Guard and members of the Senate. Caligula's death caused mixed feelings among the public. He was remembered by some as a leader who was loved and helped the people, while by others he was seen as a despotic and ruthless tyrant. As a result, Caligula's reign went down in history as a dark Roman emperor with an interesting and complex character. He was the cruelest, most sadistic most ruthless ruler of the period. According to some, this evil was thought to be caused by his illness, but according to others, these evils were His period is a period filled with the political and social dynamics of the Roman Empire. It is still studied by historians and researchers.